Hello, I'm Carla Calderon, and I'm going to show you how to create your own reward system using Google Slides. Here we go. All right, you guys, so here we are in my Google Drive. So what you're going to do is you're going to click on New and Google Slides. And we're just waiting for this to load. I'm going to name this Mario Bros. Okay. And what I'm going to do is I'm going to delete all this. So select and delete. And I'm going to X this here. Now we need a background. So the first thing is I'm going to open a new tab and I'm going to put Mario Bros. background. And then we're going to go to images and let's look for a picture with just the background because we will be adding the characters on the background. So here we go. Let's see. I think I'm going to use this one. So I select the image and then I'm just going to left click copy link address and then let's see I'm going to now paste it onto the search bar and then this should come up okay so now because I really want just the background on its own let's see if it will let me so basically I'm gonna get on the image again and then click on copy link address Let's see, because it's supposed to just take me directly to that image. So see, now I got the actual um, website, I guess, or URL to this image. So this is it. Let me go back to the Google slide. I'm going to click on background, choose, buy URL, and then here I'm just going to put this code. And then see, it shows me the image. Now I want to make sure that you guys understand this. So let me erase this and back up a little bit. So what happened is that, let me click back. So whenever this shows, and if I would have used that uh, code here, then all of these things that you see around, it will not be the actual image. So look, let me go back to Google Slides. Then I'm going to put that there. And you see how it says we can't find image? That's because that is not the actual image URL. It's basically this website that I'm giving the link to. So that's why you have to make sure that you copy the image um, link address. And whenever you have it, then make sure that you are making sure that it is the correct one. Like, see, that's it. So now I'm going to go back and then there it is. Okay, so that's how my background looks. Now I'm going back to the website and I'm going to look now for a Mario Bros. PNG. The reason we do PNG is because it is a clear background let me show you an example this one here even though it seems like there's like little squares be careful because if you try to copy this image watch so I'll copy the image and I'm gonna put it here then look how the background looks so that's not what we want that's why you have to make sure that you are selecting the correct ones um, I don't want it Josh Hold on, let's see. Mm -mm -mm. I like this one. <laughs> I think that will look pretty cool. So copy image. And let's go to edit, paste, or you can just go command and V or control V and then it just puts it right on the slide. Now let me resize this because it's way too big. Well, no, you know what? What if I do it like this? 
Uh, see, that looks like he's stepping on this. Or he's like walking on those blocks. All right, so now I need, hmm, let me get that mushroom. There it is. There's a mushroom. Copy image. There it is. So now, in this way, I can say that the mushroom was falling down and Mario got it. And that's why he's so big. Mm. Okay, so this is the thing. On this, I need to send the mushroom behind Mario. So I'm gonna click the image and I'm gonna go to Arrange, Order, Send to Back. So now you can see that Mario is in front of um, the mushroom. Hmm. What else should I add? Oh, let's get a bad guy. I don't know his name, I'm sorry. I am not <laughs> such a good fan, I guess, of Mario. I mean, I love Mario, but not to the point of knowing like who is who. I have my best friend who has his classroom all about Mario. So if he's watching this video, he's gonna be like, Carla, how dare you? <laughs> so there it is. I'm gonna put it right there, like he's walking that way. Hmm. What else? Oh, let's get the princess. And basically I'm trying to select five items because normally we teachers like to give at least five stars and that's the reason that I'm picking five, five items or five characters, I would say. And let's see, where can I put her? Oh, maybe I can put her right here. Okay, so right there. And then... So now it looks like she's coming out of this. Nope, she's like flying. Bring it down just a little bit. Okay, I think that's good. She's kind of big, no? Mm, I could resize it later. Mm, let's see, so then now I can go maybe... Oh, I thought that that was... Luigi, so I was looking for a Luigi with a Joshi, so ah, I wish that was it, but look, you see those squares? Oh, maybe this one won't work. Huh. I don't know. Let's see. Sometimes you just have to try it and see. Perfect. Yay. Okay, so I thought that Joshi was green. So more than likely this one, his name is something else. So <laughs> I'm sorry if you're a Mario fan. I'm so sorry. I don't mean to you know this, but mm. all right. So there, I've kind of resized it, and I guess the princess is kind of big. So let me make her a little bit smaller. Oh, but then the princess is taller than them both, right? So, never mind. Okay, there. Now, let's go ahead and add some transitions. And that's the way that we animate this Google Slide. So, um, if you have this selected, then you won't see the option up here. So, you have to click out. And then you will see the word transition. So click on transition. And then this is going to open. Now let's see. The first thing that we want to show on the slide is going to be this mushroom. So let me select the mushroom. And now I'm going to click here. It says select an object to animate. And I want him to fly in from the top. So that way it comes down. And it's going to be on click because every time that we click, I'll show you what I'm talking about in a minute. Um, the next thing is I'm gonna need Mario because it's gonna fly down. So 
like Mario is just going to okay so select Mario select an object to animate and I'm just gonna keep it in fading now I could also do this slow medium or fast I'm just going to leave it like that for right now which will be the next one I think let's put the bad guy here so select an object to animate and I'm going to make him fly from the right and fly in I'm clicking fly in because if I click fly out then instead of coming into the slide it's going to come out of the slide so fly in from the right uh, the princess now she can fly in from the bottom and lastly Luigi and I think I'm gonna make him fly in from the left okay so now that's pretty much it now let me show you how this looks so to present this you just go present there is our pretty background and then all you do is you just click so whenever the student does something good there is that mushroom there's Mario I don't know his name I'm so sorry there's the princess and then there's Luigi and that's it this is how you create your own reward system as you can see it is not that hard to create your own reward system using Google Slides and if you like Mario Bros and you like this reward system that I already created, then leave me a comment down below with your email address so that way I can share it with you. Don't forget to share this video with your friends, like this video, subscribe to my channel, and to click on the bell so you get notifications as soon as I upload a new video. Thank you for watching and I'll see you next time.